I'm Howard Hale. Thanks for joining us for the Cattleman's Corner. I'll be back with today's guest right after this. One of our websites is cattlemanscorner.com, and there are some good sales on cattlemanscorner.com. One of them that's coming up is Top Herefords. That's going to be on February the 12th at Grace City, North Dakota. Outstanding program, and it's an outstanding place for you to find it, cattlemanscorner.com. So anytime you're looking for good cattle, go to cattlemanscorner.com. New programs up there five days a week, cattlemanscorner.com. Jimmy Emmons Farms and produces cattle in northwestern Oklahoma. Is a no-till farmer and uses a lot of cover crops. How do you utilize those cover crops, Jimmy? The cover crops then behind the cereal grain, we'll plant a warm season mix and, and we'll graze that. So we'll give our native range a, a break, move the cows to that. Or if we have fall kids, we'll wean them uh, and graze them summer uh, covers there. In the wintertime, when we get our cereal covers behind beans and peas planted, if, if it comes on quick enough, we'll graze that through the winter and then take off in time for it to really kick off up through the spring here and give us some good cover. So you don't have to use a lot of winter feed then? It's pretty much, uh, you're pretty much able to graze it? We really, really cut back on the amount of hay and, and, and feed that we're feeding now, and we're, we're going to continue that trend i'd like to get down where uh, we only use hay in a, a snow or an ice emergency so yes that's uh, really starting to help jimmy emmons who farms and ranches in northwestern oklahoma thanks for joining us for the cattleman's corner always great to have you along more on the web at cattlemanscorner.com may god bless and you come back and join us again won't you i'm howard hale